What's going on guys? Welcome back to another nutrition video. So I went for lunch the other day with two of my friends. I ordered a bottle of water. My other friend ordered sparkling water while the third friend ordered a can of Pepsi. So I asked him, I was like, why Why do you order Pepsi? Because it's been a while while I've sat with someone that has drank Pepsi because everyone around me has gradually just cut down or completely stopped. So my friend says, I don't know, I just have it with every meal. So I say, fine, all right. The Pepsi comes, he opens it, and that, that noise, you know when you open a can of Coke, the way they show it in the ads, and then you pour it in a glass, that sound, that smell. It made me crave Coke so much. I was like, I need a can of Coke right now. And that's when I decided that my next video is about why you should stop drinking all kinds of soda. Now, everything that I just said that why you start craving it as soon as you actually hear it, see it or smell it, it's more than just a, a marketing scheme. There's a bigger reason behind it why you psychologically stop craving it. To put it simply, the amount of sugar that goes into these drinks and the amount of caffeine that goes into this, these drinks is what you actually end up craving. Scientists have actually done studies where they have come to the conclusion that because of the amount of sugar in, in sodas, it's actually either as addictive or probably more addictive than, than some class A drugs. Yeah, look, I'm not going to deep dive into the contents of a can of Coke or Pepsi or 7-Up or whatever soda you like drinking. You can always go online and look that up. I'm actually here to just give you a very simple reason or a few simple reasons why you should actually stop for good. The first reason being hydration. You've heard of this little thing. You need to drink water to survive, to be healthy, to have clear skin, to lose weight and all of that good stuff. People in some countries are actually drinking Coca-Cola instead of drinking water because that's their source of hydration. Coca-Cola is actually more accessible and cheaper than fresh water. You have access to good clean water. You should be drinking that. You should not be relying on sodas to hydrate yourself. Yes, each can of soda has a bunch of water in it as well, but that really doesn't help. Soda actually in turn dehydrates you because of the amount of caffeine in it. Next up, a very quick point because I hope it's scary enough for you and it's dental hygiene. Nobody, 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 nobody wants bad teeth, right? Soda is probably the worst thing you can consume for your teeth because everything in a soda is actually harming and destroying your tooth enamel and that's just not good. Look it up, it's not good. Just Trust me. Another big issue, heart diseases, blood pressure, sugar levels, diabetes, and a few of the other really, really scary stuff that you do not want to see on your medical report when you go to the doctor, right? Most of this is being caused by consuming too much soda, which again is because of the high amount of processed sugar that goes into a single can. Now, I can't stress enough on how much sugar goes into a single can of coke like it is unbelievable which brings me to my next reason for you to stop drinking coke or sodas and that is obesity sodas are among the top three if not the highest contributors to obesity globally right look to me drinking soda just doesn't make sense because if you think about it this way consuming all of those calories through a single can of soda versus eating all those calories what's going to keep you more fuller in fact soda doesn't fill you up at all what that means is you're consuming something that is making no difference to how full you feel but it's still giving you a very high calorie count which means all the hard work that you've been putting in the gym, in the kitchen, all the diet that you've been going after is useless because of this. I've recently stopped drinking zero calorie drinks as well, like Coke Zero, Diet Coke, and all the other things because everybody thinks that yes, you know, they don't have any calories, you can drink them, they're healthier, but they're not because all the artificial sweetness that go inside all of those drinks actually have the same effect as the processed sugar on your livers when it comes to storing fat. <laughs> so guys, I guess what I'm trying to say is stop drinking soda. Now, if this video was helpful at all, please do give it a like. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing so you don't miss what the next video is about. As always, let me know what topics you want me to cover in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys, and stay safe.